praying mantis prays and the click beetle clicks. Oh, to be a ladybug. <laughs> hey, son of a gun, that was a quickie. So was that. It's true, I've had five different husbands. But wouldn't it be idiotic to have five husbands all the same? Now that was a quick one. And now, what was the most asked question of the week? The most asked question this week was, what was the largest kidney stone ever removed? And the answer is? A 28-pound kidney stone removed from a Mr. Sam Wiseboard. And now the second most asked question was? What is the loudest sound ever heard on Earth? And the answer is? The loudest sound on earth ever heard was made by Mr. Sam Weisbord when they removed that 28-pound kidney. Well, gentlemen, if goody cigarette sales are to survive, we're going to have to do something to sell them to the public, and we're going to have to do it fast. Well, we've been experimenting with mice down at the laboratory. Yeah. Okay, bring them in. taking the word of a moldy mouse over these health nuts that are bad-mouthing cigarettes anyway. Now, do something. How about the sophisticated approach? All right. All right, Lance. Hello, hello, hello. I want to tell you that my social life really swings since I shifted to goody cigarettes. After all, <laughs> what girl can resist a man who gives her a goody? <laughs> 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 Anything to help fight the health scare, we're in big trouble. Hold it, Chief. You know, uh, the boys in adver advertising have one more card to play. This one will really boost sales. Okay, bring her in. Remember, goody cigarettes are good for you. At least smoking and coughing gives you something to do. <laughs> good. <coughs> Very good. <laughs> Deep, deep, deep. Bravo. Bravo. Hi there. I haven't seen you on the lily pads before. Deep, deep. I'm new in this pond. What do you say we get together? Deep. Bravo. Groovy. Your pad or mine? Toy boat, toy boat. And I say, if you believe, you can be healed. Now come forth and be healed. Oh, I see you have rheumatism, my friend. Open your hands. I can't. I can't. Then kneel down, my friend. Oh, spirits within me, ease this woman's rheumatism so that her hand shall be healed. Now, open your hand. I can't! I can't! 
Chicago is. Ready? Yeah. Ready? I created you. I breathed life into you. <laughs> Do you have to put garlic on everything? <laughs> Hi. Oh, dear. Can I? Sure, sure you would enjoy a cigarette after dinner. Well, you're here. Thank you. But where's your dinner? Where's this coming? Is that coming? Oh, five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Dumb bum. <laughs> Mr. Humpy Dink, mm. would you sing a song for me? I will, if you recite a poem. Sure. <laughs> oh, Engelbert Humpy Dink, when you drive, does your bumper clink? <laughs> Come on, it's time for the party. Not yet. We're planning a surprise. For whom? For Dan, but don't tell him. <laughs> well, you just did, you doo-doo. All right, but don't let on you know when we get there. <laughs> Come on, let's go to the party. Right? The surprise party. Zip. <laughs> There's nobody here. Surprise! <laughs> I went to the artist ball last week and danced with my favorite models. I was a sensation. No one has ever seen anyone tango with two apples, a bull, and a daffodil. <laughs> Yes. <clears throat> Over here in America, we call a man who is short-sighted myopic. Yes. What do you call such a man in England? Prime Minister. <laughs> Boris' wife called last night and demanded a divorce. He was so upset, he could hardly get back to sleep. I mean, <laughs> <world. laughs> He told me about it this morning. <laughs> The Lord created heaven and earth in just six days. If he hadn't rested on the Sabbath, he might even have finished Burbank. Last week I auditioned for the producer of a nude play. Now I know why I had to take my clothes off, but I still don't understand why he did. Not to mention the ushers, the parking lot attendants, and a cute little old cleaning man who was too much. <laughs> daughter-in-law wrote her mother and told her that I was a meddling old busybody. Now, I never would have known if I hadn't steamed that letter open. Now, there's nothing like Thanksgiving with relations. Oh, and to think I wasted the whole day with my family. Rosmeko, yes, what's, uh, what's the national sport in your country? Well, uh, in old country, we no longer have it national sport. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the government sent her to Siberia. Oh, dear. Hey, Goldie, you want a cookie? Teresa! No, you <laughs> You know what, you're much fatter this year than you were last year. <laughs> Continue the poverty program. Don't ask me. I never watch ABC. 